Welcome to today's edition of the AII, watching stock news, deal tracker, and advancements in artificial intelligence. Hello everyone, this is Sam Mowers here. Welcome to another episode of the AII podcast. For stock news today, GBT has filed a trademark application for its Avant AI, and IBM has launched an RFP for water management solutions. Then we're going to take a look at some projections for the global enterprise AI market. But just before we get into the show today, a quick reminder that if you enjoy this podcast, please feel free to share it or leave us a review. And as always, I recommend checking out some of the other podcasts on InvestorIdeas.com. This includes the Cannabis Podcast, the Clean Tech and Climate Change Podcast, as well as many others, all of which will bring you up to speed on the latest stock news and trends in their respective spaces. All right, so GBT Technologies, Inc., which trades on the OTC Pink under the ticker symbol GTCH, has filed a federal trademark application through its partially owned subsidiary GBT Tokenized Corp., for its Avant AI technology. Tokenize, according to the press release, is currently working to enhance the dialogue interface for Avant AI, targeting more robust Q&A possibilities, combined with easier and more friendly user interactions. Danny Rittman, GBT's CTO, explains, quote, Tokenize is trademarking Avant AI technology as it is gearing up for its new release in the next upcoming months. Since its release, Avant's core technology has been used in other derivative applications. The most recent one is Hippocrates, www.hmd.care. Hippocrates is a health information system released as a POC version, focusing on both preventive and primary care to provide first line of health-related advice and recommendations. Avant is currently under development to enhance its NLP technology, and to provide a robust user's interaction experience. Additionally, Tokenize is equipping it with summarization techniques to provide faster and enhanced informational coverage. End quote. Next up, IBM, which trades on the New York Stock Exchange under the ticker symbol IBM, has launched an RFP as part of the IBM Sustainability Accelerator, which will focus on water management solutions. This program, according to the press release, applies IBM technologies including hybrid cloud and artificial intelligence and an ecosystem of experts to enhance and scale projects focused on populations vulnerable to environmental threats. IBM's VP and Chief Impact Officer Justina Nixon Santil said, quote, Water management for the world's most vulnerable communities is a tremendous challenge. Following our first two cohorts on sustainable agriculture and clean energy, now we look forward to working with organizations with initiatives that scale technology solutions that will support communities in overcoming water challenges, including shortages, pollution, or conservation. End quote. We'll leave stocks there for the day and take a look now at a report published by Vantage Market Research, which finds that the global market for enterprise AI is projected to grow from 11.1 billion USD in 2021 to 64.5 billion dollars by 2028, registering a compound annual growth rate of 34.1% over the forecast period. The following excerpt from the report's description outline some factors influencing the market's growth. Quote, By incorporating AI, companies can save money, boost their efficiency, and be able to generate insights that help them enter new markets. Enterprise artificial intelligence applications enable a change to maximize sales, optimize the supply chain, improve products, enhance customer service, sharpen cybersecurity, and several other tasks. Enterprise AI helps companies to make data-driven decisions. Major factors contributing to the market's growth include a shift in business models from traditional, which will increase the forecast of the global enterprise AI market during the forecast period. End quote. 
And that's it for today's AII. If you would like to be a guest or sponsor for this podcast, contact InvestorIdeas.com. Investor Ideas reminds all listeners to read our disclaimers and disclosures on the InvestorIdeas.com website. And this podcast is not an endorsement to buy products or services or securities. Investors are reminded all investment involves risk and possible loss of investment. To hear more InvestorIdeas.com podcasts, please visit InvestorIdeas.com slash audio. And a reminder, you can also hear our podcasts on Apple Podcasts, Audible, Spotify, TuneIn, Stitcher, Spreaker.com, iHeartRadio, Google Podcasts, and most audio platforms available. To learn more about GBT Technologies, Inc., please visit goforprotocol.com or visit the InvestorIdeas.com profile page at InvestorIdeas.com slash CO slash G-O-P-H. And for disclosure purposes, GBT Technologies is a PR news and social media featured company on InvestorIdeas.com.